Alright, so welcome back to another video. Today we were talking about some issues people are having in regards to the skin creation videos. So without further ado, let's just get right into it. I'll be providing some solutions to the problems and it's just a quick and easy video. So let's go. The first issue people are having is in regards to the resource compilation error. Now this usually means that the base texture or since recently the albedo texture cannot find the file so this file path is most likely incorrect now a way to solve this is simply going into your cs2 folder and actually going to the file path and you just want to copy this file name and paste it at the back here and then just copy this part only now some people have been using the full file path but that won't work so only use materials custom and then the name of your skin so just copy this paste it in the workshop editor and that should solve your issue about the resource compilation error so that is the first issue now the second issue is with the texture placement so the placement is off or it just doesn't look right then probably these values are not set to zero they are just random values so you probably want to set this to zero and also enable this option if it isn't already. Now if putting this to zero and this being enabled doesn't fix the issue, what you want to do is maybe play around with these values and if that won't work, just leave a comment down below and I'll help you out further. But that is the most common issue that I have noticed. And then as I have said before, not really an issue, but the base texture is now called albedo texture. Now it's still the same, but it's just a different name. All right, so the next issue people were having is that the texture paint, the paint part, is not being added to the back of the weapon as well. Now, in order to actually get this in working, is you want to come over to the tool part over here, make sure you are in texture paint mode, and you want to come to the bottom here where it says options, and over here you want to disable occlude and back face culling. Now, if you actually draw on the skin, you can see that it will also apply to the back as well. So that is a way to quickly fix that issue. All right, so I actually forgot another part in the workshop tools, which is the stall detected error. Now this usually means that the workshop tools took too long to process your files. Now I have had some people come to me with this issue and I have told them this. It's to come to your CS2 folder and you come over to game, bin, win64 and then over here you want to right click on csgo cfg.exe and then over here you want to click on run as administrator so what this will do is it will run as an administrator obviously and resolve this issue for you where you have the stall detected error when trying to inspect or preview a skin so that was actually the last problem or common issue that i have found so as i've said it's a quick video, very easy. If you are still having any more issues, please just let me know in the comments and I will help you as best as I can. And thank you very much for watching. Like and subscribe because I'm trying to reach a thousand subs by the end of the year. And I'll talk to you later. Bye bye.